Uh, hello friends, uh, friends uh, today we will discuss about AIR3239 antenna okay? and uh, that is the antenna integrated radio unit uh, which is used for 5G technology, 5G TDD okay? so we will discuss about more and we will get also I mean we will know also how I mean we can install this radio okay so let's see full video if you are new then please subscribe my channel okay so uh, AIR3239 is a I mean uh, 32 TR uh, TDD is for NR, okay. NR, I mean for new radio, uh, new new radio. Um, I mean support 5G technology, and S S means a uh, advanced antenna system. So AIR3239 is a advanced antenna system. It support 5G technology, okay. And this uh, I mean antenna also having 32 transmit uh, transmitter and receiver. Uh, and we can see here. I uh, means so the TX and RX are having same branches. I mean in this. Uh, Antenna, I mean in AIR3239 antenna and AIR3239 uh, antenna also support ECP. ECP means uh, enhanced uh, common public radio interface. <coughs> okay, why I mean using enhanced uh, CP because in enhanced CP used for I mean uh, redu uh, redu reduce traffic pressure in the fiber. Okay, that is why I mean AIR3239 I mean support ECP because uh, AIR3239 uh, used for 5G technology as we know that. Okay. And the AIR unit set up uh, connection with basement by ECP interface and 10.3 GPS internet port. Okay, so 10.3 GPS internet port where we have to connect CP, uh, ECP interface. Okay, uh, in basement. Okay, and now we can see here. I mean, uh, how much I mean power uh, I mean is taking this radio. We can see here uh, 100 watt maximum. Okay, Nom nominal power uh, output power is there for this. Uh, I mean antenna number of carrier uh, we can see here up to three and frequency support i mean 3500 to 3700 megahertz i mean it's it it, it will support 3500 3600 and 3700 megahertz okay and uh, we can see here uh, uh, ar3239 okay and height width and depth we can see here this is our height okay we can see in mm okay 563 and 4 411 this is our i mean this i mean width and and depth we have this one C number one double six okay and also I mean we can see here weight of uh, weight of AIR antenna so without uh, I mean mounting kit so it it would be I mean 24 kb uh, 24.4 kg okay and with mounting kit uh, we can see here I mean say, uh, almost 25 kg okay and we can also use a fuse rating 25 ampere uh, and uh, instead of 25 ampere also we can use i mean uh, 16 ampere and 20 ampere but maximum we have to use 25 uh, 25 ampere for this uh, i mean ir3239 okay uh, okay so now we have next page also here we can see how i mean we can i mean install the radio antenna so uh, this is uh, this radio antenna has been installed on pipe okay we can see here our mechanical tilt uh, and here uh, there is no mechanical tilt because mechanical tilt we have installed on top okay but in in second uh, picture you, you can see uh, mechanical tilt installed in bottom and pic in picture 3 there is no mechanical tilt okay so mechanical uh, i mean tilt bracket uh, inst uh, installation i mean you have to do according to plan okay you have to check in plan sheet and where i mean you have to install mechanical tilt on site so according to plan i mean you have to install mechanical tilt i mean top and top and bottom or without mechanical tilt we can see here uh, a that is radom and b lsap bracket we have and c cooling fins and d our connection interface of where we have to connect i mean uh, power cable or optical cable and grounding uh, you can give the alarm also okay and we can see here this is our i mean radio position when you will you can move the radio okay left to right like that okay and also now we have we can see here i mean interface uh, i mean details here so a, a is our i mean tx monitor or where we have to connect i mean sma female connector okay b we have what optical indicator where uh, we can see our i mean optical uh, if any alarm reporting in optical cable so we can know from i mean led okay if uh, optical cable went faulty then uh, optical indicator it would be in red color if any uh, alarm is there so it would be in yellow color okay if there is no alarm so it it would be i mean in green color okay so optical indicator is there we can see 
okay uh, because see what is happening generally when i mean we are connecting i mean uh, optical cable from basement to radio so we are checking led status is green or not okay if green is there then uh, uh, we are thinking that yes i mean uh, i mean radio uh, i mean air antenna to basement uh, now i mean uh, i mean has been connected properly so they know so there is no problem okay c number we have i mean external alarm if you want to give the external alarm from the air 32392 to infra then you can give okay d number we have optical synchronization timing okay you have to connect here also i mean uh, lc lc fiber okay and first we have to insert the sfp here okay then you have to connect the i mean fiber and now we have i mean three uh, port of a uh, uh, optical a uh, port uh, we can see here efg so efg our optical port is there where we have we have to connect optical cable uh, which is called also cp cable okay so uh, this ports i mean uh, this port having ecp as i told it ecp means uh, enhanced common public radio interface okay so we have ecp i mean three ports where we have to connect but generally for 5g uh, we are connecting uh, we are using only ecp 1 and 2 i mean data 1 and 2 uh, i mean f and g port and also we have to connect here power power cable connector okay and you can give the minus 48 volt dc power supply okay here and and last also we have to connect a grounding cable here and you can use here two m6 volt okay please uh, i mean you have to tighten the two i mean m6 volt here when you will connect the grounding cable to ar3239 and grounding uh, grounding is very important okay as we know that in telecom sector so if you are i mean installing the ir ir3239 antenna so before power up you have to uh, i mean grounding you have to give the grounding grounding for ir3239 okay so now we can see here how i mean this radio you can install on pipe so uh, we can see here this is our ir3239 antenna and also you can see the grounding is connected here and to uh, you can see here cp cable i mean you can call as optical or fiber cable and we have power connector and you can see here mechanical tilt install on top okay and all i mean uh, bolt and nut i mean straighten is there okay and cable routing also you can see uh, and fixed with the zip tie here okay so yes uh, in, uh, i mean uh, in this site okay uh, according to plan mechanical tilt should be installed on top that you are install on top okay if in plan you will get you will get the information you have to install mechanical tin in bottom then you have to install mechanical tin in bottom but here is plan to install on top so that you why i mean mechanical tin we can see on top okay uh, now we can see here also uh, mechanical tilt on top in in this way and now we can see here i mean so this is our interface port and two cable we are using for 5g technology data 1 and data 2 okay and this is our power can power cable with connector uh, here we have to connect a connector and grounding is very important as i told that okay without grounding we cannot i mean power up this radio okay so give the grounding then you can power up okay so uh, grounding is very important optical indicator we can see here okay so, and two and one number this is our optical indicator so there is no alarm that you are it is showing led uh, led status in green and we can see here i mean part number here and uh, and our radio is 3 to 39 b78 means 3500 to 3700 band it will support okay now we can see also how i mean uh, if you install the radio on antenna then you, you will look from the far then how it will look like so you, we can see here this is our radio ir3239 antenna so which is installed above of combo antenna here okay we can see here i mean closed picture so okay this type we can see okay so uh, if uh, if you are going to install ir3 to 3 antenna on pole on tower on wall so you can install easily okay and yeah uh, this was information for ir3239 guys so if you are new on my channel please subscribe my channel because here we will know about all technical information okay that would be helpful for inter for interview also so okay guys we will meet in next video okay thank you and jai hind